to open Trapeze, you can simply select a plan and drag it over to the Trapeze icon. In this case, it's the elevations of an extension to an apartment building. I need to make that a little bit bigger. Now, from the tool menu, I'm going to select the overlay annotation tool. Within this, there are a series of overlays arranged in folders covering a range of planning, building and traffic engineering matters derived from the planning scheme, Australian standards and the like. Clearance to car parking spaces, curved ramp design, driveway sections, ramp gradients, the Victorian Res Code provisions, reverse manoeuvres for both B85 and B99 vehicles, shadows for winter, solstice, summer solstice and the equinox, turning circles, internal radius and in this case some custom overlays for a particular council. I'm going to go back to the Res Code provisions and look at the side and rear setbacks control. Trapeze always reminds you to check that the scale is consistent. In this case, 1 to 50. The overlay appears and it's arranged in the correct position for assessment. Straight away you can see that there's an area of this building that doesn't comply with the provisions. I'm now going to have a look at the other end of the building, repeating the exercise going to the Resco tools, in this case the side and rear setbacks right overlay. Arrange that approximately. You can see that there's some area of non-compliance but it's not as marked as on the other side. Now I might save this drawing, in fact I've already done that and I have another version of it which I'm going to use to demonstrate how planning assessment could be used in a report scenario. So I won't change that. Save that. This is my planning assessment folder. I'm going to open that elevation. And using the polygon tool, I've drawn that outline of the non-compliant part of this building to highlight the issue and I've written a little basic note here. Now that could be sent to a planning report or used to advise the applicant in terms of an email or indeed uh, to resolve a planning dispute.